What's good, everybody? Welcome back to another video today. We got some AirPod Pros 2. Originally, I've been using AirPod 1, and I think those came out in like, what, 2016 or something like that? They came out a minute ago. And I've always had them, had no issues, you know, everything worked fine. And I think I lost them or something, I don't know. So the past few days, I haven't had any AirPods. My the last location is in the house, so it should be somewhere in here. I just don't know where it is. They're dead, so I can't ping them. So yeah. So Shelly actually had a good idea and was like, "Why don't you get some AirPod Pros? They're on sale at Target. I picked these up for 200." And I said, like, "Okay, why not? Wireless charging and everything." So yeah, we're gonna unbox this bad boy today and kind of see what they're about. Before we start unboxing it, let's just take a look at the box. Pretty simple. Um, AirPods Pro are a little bit bigger than the regular AirPods, so. Obviously, the box is going to be a little bigger. I've had my AirPods for so long. You know, I never really looked into AirPod 2s and AirPods Pros and AirPods Pro 2s and blah, blah, blah. But I just figured, you know what? My AirPods is lost somewhere in the crib. Let me upgrade. Get the, get something new. And they just released some new uh, headphones where they go over the ears. But, yeah, so the box is easy to unbox. And boom. So you get a little book designed by Apple California, of course. And then you get the case, of course. So I wish I had my AirPod 1 so I can compare the two together. Like I said, it's lost somewhere in my house. But the case, so the AirPods probably would be like this, pretty much. And you'll pop it open like that, size wise. So now these are sideways because I think these are bigger. But before we get into that, let's see what else they come with. It should come with a. Extra charger. Oh, so you get the new USB C charger. So I'm still using a um, iPhone 11, so I don't get the so I haven't been using the USB C type ports. But when the 13 comes out, I'm definitely getting that bad boy. You can take advantage of fast charging, but yeah, you get this cable, which is pretty cool, and that's pretty much in the packaging. So you get the charger, the thing, Majiggy. Oh, and you also get this too. So the different earbuds. So, okay. So you get different sizes for your ears. I'm assuming the earbuds already have ones on them. Let's clean up a little bit and then let's see. The wire over here. Those are still over there. Unravel this bad boy. So yeah, so the same charger port in the bottom. Um, it feels a little bit heavier than the regular AirPods. Oh, this is different. Okay. They haven't been paired, so I gotta pair them to my phone, but... Interesting. So, um... From this side, they're a lot... They're a little bit bigger. They're not, you know, huge. They're still pretty small. I mean, you see it in my hand. It's not... It's not brolic or nothing like that. But, um, they do come with buds. So, you get three. So, you get one set that's already on the headphones and then two other more sets. You can see, try them on, see what fits your ears. I ordered a case for this too, so wait for that to come in for right now. Okay, so they just drop in like that. Has like a little magnet charger thing that grabs it like that. So you don't have to worry about not putting it in right. And I don't think you can put the wrong side in. Let's test that out. So. So yeah, you can put the wrong thing, it won't fit. That's fine. So these come with noise um, canceling. I forgot what it's called, some type of option crap. I mean, it's probably in the book, to be honest. But yeah, so you can kind of like cancel out the the background if you want to. And this is always, this is, I guess this is how you set it up. It will show you how to change the air tips and everything. Connection, one thing about AirPods is if you're using like the Apple ecosystem, it's so easy to pair things up. It's just like everything goes seamless. So I'm gonna pair my phone and try them out. Uh, and it looks like when you're using these, you get a new option on your phone for a noise control. And I guess that's how you can touch and hold the volume. Interesting, okay. Usually you would tap the top part to like next track or pause, or you go into um, the settings and adjust to what you want the settings to be. 
but you have these stems and you grip these things. So you tap these or you hold them or blah, 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 blah. Instead of tapping them in the air. I think it's better that way because when they're in your ears and you're tapping them and you're pushing them down your ear, it's kind of annoying, but just grabbing these or like that, that is a lot better. So I heard the battery life on these is a lot, I guess there's a bigger battery in them. So the battery life is a lot better. Charging is a lot faster. Also just has wireless charging. So I can drop this on any pad and charge them, which I lacked in the AirPod ones that I had. And I was actually was thinking about upgrading to AirPods 2 because of the wireless charging, but I'm like, I don't need it, whatever. But now I got these Pro 2s, Gucci, you know? I'm using my iPad and show you guys how easy it is to pair them, actually. So let's say you have your iPhone. I'm using my iPad, I'm recording my iPhone. You just put them next to each other and raise it up and then it'll just automatically connect just like that. And that's it. So I, I believe since I already have these paired to my cell phone, they just automatically pair to the um, iPad, I guess, which is pretty cool. So actually, let, let me put one in. I got the AirPods Pro plug on. Oh, wow. So I have them in my ears right now and it sounds like I'm talking to my ears weird. Then you know when your ear ears is like plugged up. So you can either turn on noise cancellation or turn on, on transparency. That's what it's called. What the heck was I talking about earlier? So when you turn this on, my fan, my ceiling fan that's like above, I can hear way more wind noise coming from the fan, which is crazy. And if I turn it off, then it's like normal. So I hear the fan and it's kind of noise cancellation going on. But you guys can see just looking at the control, it's crazy. So noise cancellation literally will have you talking to yourself and it's all you can hear. You can't hear nothing on the outside. Right now, I just, I hear myself and that's it. And then you turn it off. And then it's crazy how this works. You turn it off, now you can hear more on the outside, more yourself. And then you hear like, it's crazy. Like I hear the ceiling fan wow into my ears right now. So this is gonna be interesting to use. I'm gonna test these for the next few days, play some music, how, see how music sounds. And a lot of um, music providers or platforms right now, they have it where there's like, uh, dang, I don't know what this is. Like, like Apple Music. Apple Music got the Dolby something where it's like surround sounding ears I'll or something. Like, and I'll be able to test that out and stuff. But yeah, this thing is crazy. Like it's, I think it's a good, it's a definitely a good upgrade from AirPods 1. If you have AirPods 2, it is an also a good upgrade if you're looking to, I don't know, you want noise cancellation 1. You want something with better um, battery life. You want something... Quality is a tad better, I would say. It's not nothing crazy. Remember, these are small headphones in your ears. And I'm gonna jump on the website real fast so you guys can just get an idea. So, oh, you can actually, look at this. You can actually compare it. So just give you guys an, an heads up. Maybe I've missed something here, but you see, you have the different uh, sound settings that the pros have that the AirPods don't have. Always on, it's cool. Noise cancellation. So the battery life shows that on the these are twos i believe airpod twos the battery life are better on those than these but some people are saying that the battery life is better on these i, was, I, I don't know what apple is i don't know what's going on there but i'm gonna have to test this out and see and you can get one with wireless or not these come standard wireless and then these are the new Macs, of course but we're gonna talk about that but just to sum everything up these things they feel very light i feel like it's not, it's, a, it's compared to my airpod ones Put it in my ears. Look at that, I'm putting it in wrong already. I already used to putting these in here already. I'm just like, I'm gonna be trying to figure it out. I'm like, is this the right side? But yeah, I'm gonna test these out, see how they feel. I'm gonna see what the vibe is about, you feel me? And go from there. Already they feel a lot better. The wireless is just clutch. I'm um, gonna see how long it takes to charge these bad boys. See how long they last. Um, the air buds that come with the headphones already. Oh. Why is it like an S? Oh, they have sizes. So this is focus camera. So we see how this is S. I guess small and large. And the one that's on the air buds themselves are mediums. So it's cool. They come with different sizes. But the mediums fit perfect fine with me. So I don't think I even have to change these. But thank you guys for watching. I'm going to end everything here. If you have any questions on these, answer away. I'll try to answer. Appreciate you guys for tuning in. I'll catch you guys in the next video.